hi you guys welcome to my youtube channel um this is my first video i've decided to start it off with a pick a card reading so i have three sets of cards and the question is what message does the universe want you to know right now so we have rose quartz to the left soda light in the middle and angelite to the right so i give you a few seconds maybe you want to pause the video Pick whichever card or sets of cards that you feel called to. Okay, you guys, the first set that we have is the Rose Quartz set. So, if you chose Rose Quartz, you know this is for you, of course. Okay, so, Rose Quartz. Let's see what card we have first. We have Helpful People. And when the Helpful People card pops up, it means that... You have people around you that can help you achieve your goals. Like, you may like being dependent. You may like doing things on your own. Maybe you feel like you're struggling. You have friends that can help you. You know, the universe can help you. God can help you. Your archangels and ancestors, they're here to help you. So, if you're struggling with anything, you know, you have people around you that are willing to help. The second card is the Eight of Wands. The Eight of Wands signif signifies things moving forward. It can be like relationships, a project that you're working on, um, a business that you are working on. Whatever you're doing, like, it's going to start picking up movement. If there's anything in your life that you feel like has been going slow or anything, expect it, you know, to start moving quickly. And the last card that we have is the Queen of Cups. Okay, so the Queen of Cups, as you can see, is a woman with a cup on her hand. You know, the cups represent emotions. So lately, you know, maybe you've been super emotional or you know someone around you that's been super emotional. Like, this person cares about you a lot. Or this could be you. I feel like that this person, you know, wants to talk out things with you. And you guys need to meet up because there's a lot that's up on their mind. They have a lot of things to tell you. So we're going to go ahead and move on to the second one, which is Soda Light. So. <laughs> First call we have is weight. Of course, you know that means weight. There is something that you're trying to rush or something that, you tr that you're trying to do. And... Now is not the right time. The universe wants you to wait. You may be trying to do something and you feel like you keep running into delays or bad things keep happening. Or you feel like no matter how hard you try, you're not making progress. You're probably not meant to be doing it right now. I'm not saying you shouldn't do it, but maybe there, there's things that you need to take into consideration before you try to do it. The second card is the Ace of Pentacles. The Ace of Pentacles signifies new beginnings related to money, finances, um, you know, earth signs as well. Pentacles, you know, is an earth sign card. So that's more mostly like Capricorns, Tauruses, and Virgos. Um, some of you could be coming into new jobs or getting business ideas. Some of you could also have, you know, more money coming in from, you know, random sources or whatever. Like, this is it. This is it right here. It's the card that you want. And we have the Two of Pentacles. <clears throat> Notice in the card, the man is trying to balance two different pentacles. That could be like two different things that you're trying to balance in life. Maybe you're spending more time focused on something else and it's draining all of your time and your energy you need to learn to balance things in life you can't stay focused on work you know and not have time for self-care or be too focused on romantic relationships and not focused on work no you need balance balance is always you know crucial in life you shouldn't be completely focused on something because it can drain you and Third set that we have is which is the last one, Soda Light. My favorite crystal. Well, one of my favorites. Um, the 
first card is peaceful resolution so this when some of you guys have been maybe you know struggling in life or there's been some conflict between you and someone else and you've been wondering you know will this be resolved or what's going to happen between us well this card right here is letting you guys know that you know things are going to get smoothed out between you guys you have nothing to worry about Second card is the Ten of Swords. See the man lying down? He has Ten Swords going in his back. Okay. The Ten of Swords <clears throat> means struggle, you know, defeat. Like you're extremely tired, you're overwhelmed, you're tired. Like that's the end of it. Things not going as planned. And because of this, maybe you're having a hard time, you know, coping or there's something that you're trying to do and you feel overwhelmed with it. Well, I think, you know, you need to take a break and strategize, strategize <laughs> upon, you know, what you're trying to do because this ain't it. This is not it. This is, you know, not something that you want to happen. So I think you need to take some, you know, some time out to plan things out. And the last card that we have is the Fool, which represents new beginnings. And this is cat. Oh, there, there was a cat outside. But yes, the Fool represents new beginnings. Um, taking things by faith, you know, like believing in things, surrendering to the unknown. When this pops out, it lets you know that you're going into new beginnings, of course. And you need to welcome it with open arms. I mean, of course, you know, sometimes people can be scared of the unknown. It's not something that they're used to. They don't know what's coming. But I feel like there's some pretty good things coming. You just need to be open and ready to receive. So, guys, that's all for today. This was my first YouTube video. So, I was a little bit nervous. But soon I'll be releasing more videos. Tell me, you know, if there's any other tarot spreads you guys would like to do up in the comments. You want to subscribe and give this video a like. Thank you.